speaking the hard truth that Ghanaians don't want to listen to. Mm. You see, look, and I may get into trouble for this, but Ghanaians know the truth, but we hate to be told the truth. We like to be lied to. And so when you see someone who is blunt with the truth, who tells you the truth how it is and says it to you, how it ought to be said, people end up taking issues with them. But honestly, let's sit back and ask ourselves, the things Trini Jonas has been saying, which part of it do we not agree with? What part of the facts, the system that is broken in Ghana that he's he points out, can we disagree with Maybe him? Maybe the manner he portrays that. You, you, can, you can have a... Call. On that score, you have a valid point to say he could do it in a better way. Okay? But you see, people get frustrated and they feel like, look, people ought to know better. When politicians are the ones behind those doing galamse, how then do you expect him to be nice to us politicians? Because we are the problem. When chiefs are the ones who support the galamseers and are destroying our water bodies, I'm not saying he should go and insult a chief, but he has every right to call out a chief. Because if you're a chief, you hold, you sit on that stool as a custodian for your people to protect not just the land but the natural water the bodies in there today they are using river bodies to curse him mm -hmm. what have been the activities or actions of these chiefs to protect those river gods mm -hmm. the deities they are using to curse him me i said that i don't mean i don't do those things i'm not i don't dabble in those things but if those things really do exist the river deities will protect him and instead of instead of killing him or do whatever the chiefs are asking for because his action and activism is, is asking to clean up the water bodies. You as a chief, your activities and actions are to allow Chinese come into your community and come and destroy the water body. So what are we talking about? I mean, yes, he may have to look at how to polish his approach and the way he puts out his... But this, let's look at the substance of what he is saying. Is he wrong? Yes, it's the marriage man. 24-7, is he working? Charlie Glasson, come on.